age 19, Perry Cross had the world at his feet. Until a rugby tackle left him a C2 ventilated quadriplegic. Unable to move and on a life support machine, doctors told Perry he would never leave hospital. Don't talk about it, it's hard. Because you're looking back at it. Oh, it's um, yeah, tough times. People said you've never survived. as he's known by friends, hasn't just survived, he has thrived. He's the founder and president of the Perry Cross Spinal Research Foundation, an inspirational speaker, humble hero, and a world leader in the fight against paralysis. It's a dream he shared with late Hollywood actor Christopher Reeve. We met up in New York at a, at a function and I got talking to him about curing paralysis and this is, you know, it's over 20 years ago and he said, oh, Look, mate, there'll be a cure for paralysis. It's just a matter of time. Time, money, and a touch of genius. This is Perry Cross at home on the Gold Coast and in the world of science. I hated science as a kid at school. And it's ironic. Sometimes the things you push away are the things that come back to you the most. As fate would have it, Perry would spend his adult life buried deep in research. His quest would take him around the globe, even to the United Nations. A distinguished and courageous young Australian who's leading the fight against paralysis. Before I knew it, things started to, to grow up, to, you know, gain momentum. His journey led him here to Griffith University in Southport, where a team of researchers is on the brink of a breakthrough. This is by far the most significant. You know, having um, the Spinal Injury Project, the SIP project, funded by the state government here on the Gold Coast is, is huge. It's um, world leading research and it's happening right here in our town. Among his many achievements, Perry proudly carried the Olympic torch at Sydney 2000. Okay. And now the Queen's baton on home turf. I'm thrilled to be part of such a historical moment for the Goldie. Um, and to see so many people you know, coming to the Gold Coast and athletes and you know, it's going to be brilliant. If you're lucky enough to ever meet Perry, you'll quickly learn his passion is people and helping them to battle even the greatest of odds. It's a tough gig being paralysed and, and um, we need to alleviate that, you know, disease from people's lives. We'll chase this down at the end, yeah. He's on a mission to do it.